We choose to go to the moon in this decade and do the other things, not because they are easy, but because they are hard. The original moonshot happened five decades ago, landing a man on the surface of the moon. It was a seemingly impossible dream, a test of belief and perseverance. Ten years ago, the Nigeri Connection, a partnership of churches in western Pennsylvania and Zimbabwe, including Dutil Church, set out on another moonshot to rebuild six rural medical clinics in Zimbabwe. It seemed an impossible goal, but by God's grace, we find ourselves on the threshold of achieving it. Five of the six clinics are complete. Only the clinic at Chindenga remains. These medical clinics serve as critical care facilities, providing clean, safe environments for mothers to give birth and access to treatment for people suffering from illnesses. For many, these clinics are literally a lifesaver. We are so close to completing this mission, but we need your help. We are $160,000 away from our goal of completing the final clinic. We're asking you to pray and to consider giving a special gift to support this effort. Because that goal will serve to organize and measure the best of our energies and skills. Because that challenge is one that we're willing to accept at Dutil Church, we are about to embark on Stellar, a week-long VBS in which 300 children will take a journey to the stars, discovering how they can shine the light of Jesus Christ in the world. Each day during VBS, the kids will bring their offerings, which will support TNC's Moonshot. We're asking everyone at Dutil Church to consider making a one-time special gift this week to help us finish this moonshot. You can make your donations to Dutil Church, designating them TNC Moonshot. You can give in the church offering plate at VBS or online at dutilchurch.org. The deadline for gifts is Sunday, July 2nd. We serve a God who is able to do more than we could ask or imagine, a God of the impossible, we're trusting God to help us complete this mission as we bring life-giving medical care to the people of Zimbabwe.